Hello. <laughs> Hello. Hello. Hi. Hi, everyone. What's up? <laughs> Y'all gonna have to talk to me nice from now on. Okay? You you just you just gonna. You're gonna have to talk to me nice. You know why? Because I know everything now. Okay? I know everything now. I'm a college girl. Okay? I'm a college girl. I graduated. Okay? It only took me six years. And I got my bachelor's degree. I got my diploma. Okay? My college. My official college diploma. Okay? It's so nice. Um, Now, the really nice diploma won't be here for a while because they have to, you know, mail it to me. In the meantime, I got sent a temporary diploma. I mean, I like this one kind of better than a nicer one. What do y'all think? I finally graduated and I'm somebody now. Okay, I'm somebody. I think we need to just be serious at this point, sorry. But yes, yes, I have finally graduated. It did take me six total years to get my bachelor's degree. But I mean, when you are working at the same time, you just kind of have to deal with it. Uh, throughout all these struggles of failing classes, okay, the, I've only failed two classes. If y'all have been here for a while, you have known my struggle with C++ and my computing class. Uh, I did fail computing too. So the second C++ class uh, took me three times to pass. Yeah, but I did it, okay? I passed with a C. <laughs> and then I failed um, mathematics. Mathematics of computing. Mathematics of computing was essentially like math and C++ all in one. I'm not a math girl, okay? I can't, I failed algebra in high school. <laughs> but you got math and C++ at one, that was not gonna get passed. It was just not, it was not. But I did, okay? I took it again, passed it. I got the best email, okay? And it basically was saying, welcome to graduate. Cause I am the graduate, I am the graduate. I've been working on my bachelor's degree, uh, Bachelor of Science in Computer Information Systems. I did do that route versus computer science because obviously I'm not a programmer and I don't like coding, not my jazz. So I went the other route. Uh, that's pretty much what's been taking up a lot of my time, you know, excess time, but we no longer have school to worry about. We no longer have to worry about that BS, okay? I never am, no, I am not going for my graduates. No, I am never going back to school again. No, I only went to school because I was essentially getting paid to go to school. If anybody is a GI Bill recipient, you understand what I'm talking about. I am a GI Bill recipient, so I went to school because I got paid to go to school. I don't owe nothing, okay? I, I, I came out of this with debt-free stuff, all right? Thank you to the US Air Force. This is my second degree and it's the funniest thing ever because when people find out that I have two degrees, uh, they don't really want to, I don't want to say count, but yeah, it's like they don't really count. I don't know why the world of us just doesn't really count an associate's degree, but I have an associate's degree. I've had an associate's degree way before I got a bachelor's degree. <laughs> But I guess it's not as important. I got an associate's in computer information systems, essentially. But I guess it doesn't count. But yes, I have an associate's and a bachelor's in information systems, blah, 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 blah. What's next for me now that, you know, I got my degree and I know everything? <laughs> uh, I have no idea. Pretty much, I just want to not learn anything for now. I don't want to have any obligations. I don't want to, you know, I don't know if I'm sure there are individuals out there who can agree with, with me with this. I haven't really been able to put forth uh, getting certifications because of like studying for that and then studying for my classes trying to graduate when a certification is not really a requirement at this point in time in my career nor in, I'm not required for any of my jobs. Essentially came to the conclusion that I should finish my degree and get it over with. Now though, I've always had a plan to like study and, and go for some different certifications and stuff than what I currently have. So now I'm like, wow, I don't have an excuse. That kind of sucks. Continuing education sucks. Finishing my senior project, I did my paper on, I, I opted, we could pick whatever we wanted to do for our capstone project, for the senior project. People were like creating apps and other things and I was like, who gonna do that? 
for school for school no not happening it wasn't happening so i opted to go the simple route and to write a paper and i wrote my paper on ai artificial intelligence as a whole um with a small little subset of chat gpt but i learned a hell of a lot about ai i'm not even gonna lie but that was what my senior project was on. It was like one, two, three, 12 pages. Ooh, man, ooh, who am I? 12 pages. <laughs> so I don't know what's next. I don't know what's next. Uh, before I say anything, before people always ask this question, should they get a degree, should they not? No, <sighs> I am have not been, nor will I become the type of person to tell you what to do. I'm just not, this is just, no, you're not gonna hold me liable for anything. Is a degree required for you to get into the field of IT? No, it's not, it's never been required. So people do it and there is absolutely nothing wrong with getting a degree. It's something, it's an accomplishment and it's something that you don't have to worry about someone taking away from you or it expiring, you know, like certifications expire. Oh. And it always looks good. It looks good on a resume. It shows that, you know, you're trying to, you're showing like you want to improve yourself. You're willing to learn. It's a lot that goes with a degree. Um, is it required? No. Like I said, if I wasn't getting paid to go to school, I would not be in school. But that's just because I'm not a school person. I don't do school. Does it necessarily mean that it was a bad thing? No. Do I think it's going to further my career? No, not at all. Okay, I don't. <laughs> I have had my degree as like, you know, credits and stuff that I've had my bachelor's degree on my resume for years, for since I got out the military, essentially. No one has ever asked me an ounce about my degree, a question, uh, uh, anything. I've never had to provide proof. I've never had to do anything, okay, anything. Nobody in any of my jobs cared. That doesn't mean they won't care for you certain jobs. I know if you want to pursue management, you're going to need one. If you want to go like up the, you know, climb the ladder, I don't. So, no. I don't apply for jobs, nor do I work for jobs that require a degree. So, no. Yeah, no. I would not have gotten it. I think that's it. So, what's next? I don't know. I'm just chilling. Okay, I'm chilling. But, yes. I think I might use the time. Enjoy my summer. I have no kids this summer. So, I'm going to enjoy my summer. I'm going to be outside. Studying where? Studying what? Learning what? I don't care. I don't care. I don't care. I don't care. That's my next plan. That's my short term goal. Okay, but I am going to leave this year with at least a new certification of some sorts because I already got a plan. I already got a plan. I already got it. I already got it. But yes, okay. Congratulations to me. <laughs> All right, y'all. I'm done bringing a little pretentious. Okay, have a good one. Bye.